Is your advertising working? How do you tell? Let's discover this together right after this. Hi, I'm Doug Barra, and in this episode of Business Success, we will uncover the most crucial aspects of understanding the effectiveness of your marketing. First, however, please take a moment and like this video. I am committed to getting these messages out to as many business owners as possible, and you can help. By liking this video, you tell the algorithm gods that this video is relevant and important. That way, it will get shown to more people. You can also help by sharing it with your friends and colleagues who will get value from it. When you are investing in advertising, what is your top concern? For most of us, it's, is it working? Now, notice I said investment in advertising, not spend money on advertising. Advertising takes up a significant chunk of the marketing budget for any business. And where does that line item fall on your profit and loss statement? Under expenses. However, advertising is an investment. I first got present to this when I was running my web design business. For me, advertising was an expense that I wanted to avoid at all costs. So I only did the kinds of marketing that I could do without spending any money. Two years into my business and I had a whopping three clients and they were all my friends. But unfortunately, my commitment to not spending money on advertising cost me that business. So when I learned that the only way to grow a business is to look at advertising and marketing as an investment, my ears perked up. I knew about investments. I knew that if I wanted to make money on an investment, I had to ensure that I was getting a good return on my investment. Suddenly light bulbs went off in my brain. With the investment in advertising, you need to know that you are getting a decent return on that investment. So how do you know that you're getting a good return on your investment in advertising? You have to test and measure. Testing and measuring your advertising is an essential business growth strategy. But what do you measure? And what do I mean by testing? There is a lot you can measure. For example, you can count the number of sales you get from the advertisement, the number of leads, what kinds of sales. The more you measure, the more effective you make your marketing. Testing is about making improvements to the advertising and seeing what effect that has on the measures. What makes a good advertisement? Well, there are four essential components, or goals you might say, in any advertising. We delineate them in the acronym AIDA, A-I-D-A. Attention, interest, desire, action, AIDA. Your investment must grab attention. It must stop the prospect in their tracks and have them say, this is for me. Then it must create interest. The prospect has to determine that it's worth learning more. Once you have their attention, your advertisement has to create a desire for the outcome of whatever you are offering. Finally, it must end in a clear call to action. It must tell the prospect in no uncertain terms how they can get that offer. Of course, all this is useless if you are not showing your advertisement to the right people. 
The most crucial aspect of any marketing campaign is having the right target market for that campaign. The measurements represent how these produce the outcome. You can see the impact of tweaking each one by testing it against a control. What's a control? The control is a working version of the advertisement that we can measure against. Now, how well is your current advertising working? Leave me a comment to let me know. You can probably tell that there is a lot more depth we could go into on this subject. And that's very true, as well as many other subjects that make a difference in how your business supports you and your life. Would you like to experience freedom in your business ownership? What if you could have your business create more wealth for you without having to devote more of your time? This is available when you build a solid foundation for your business. I have created this resource to show you the roadmap to that kind of business success. I call it the Insider's Guide to Success in Business. And you can download your free copy by clicking the link below this video or by visiting www.insidersguidetosuccessinbusiness.com. Please remember, like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And be sure to click the bell for all notifications so that you don't miss a single episode. Once again, I'm Doug Barra, and now it's your turn. Click the link, download your free guide, take your business to the next level, and I'll see you in our next video.